Hey everyone, well I look horrible right now and I'm super tired, but I figured I'd film this haul before I forget. So, yeah, I won't be shopping for a while, hopefully. But um, yeah, today I went to the opening of H&M in South Florida because I've never been to H&M before, so, and they just opened one in South Florida in the um, Gardens Mall, which is about 40 minutes from my house or so. So I went there and it was packed. I mean, I didn't go when they opened at 12. I went around 7-ish because I got off of work at 6.30. So me and my friends went. So I'll show you what I got. I probably would have bought more if there was nobody in there, but it was just so hard and you can try on anything. So I just tried on stuff over my tank top. It's more like a tank top. So... Yes, I'm going to show you what I got, and I'm going to try to change and show you each thing. I'm going to stop the video and start in and put it all together. So yeah, I spent $103, I believe. Their prices weren't that good, because all the stuff that was actually the grand opening sale was, like, sold out. But yeah, I wanted to get a winter jacket, but I didn't end up doing that. But yep, here we go. Okay, the bag. Yeah, I'm pretty happy, so, yeah, um, I'm gonna go back sooner or later, but, yeah, first I'm gonna show you, actually, all this I can just throw on over my shirt, so you can watch, okay, this first thing was, um, $12.95, and this is a small, in Europe sizes, don't know what that means, but, it's okay, it's just, um, white t-shirt with, like, um, what do they call it? I don't know, it's got the lines on the front. And I don't have a white t-shirt. Long sleeve one, at least. So. so it just looks like that. Thank you. I mean, you can probably get a white long sleeve t-shirt anywhere, but this one's super comfortable. I'm a little bit surprised. Okay. Oh, I just cut myself with a tag. That's nice. Okay, dokie. Okay. I felt so bad for the people working there because I could not imagine working there the first day. Everything was on the floor, literally everything. That's why I didn't even pick up much stuff. Because I didn't want clothes that were stepped on. So next I got this t shirt was like, really expensive for um <laughs> the price of seventeen ninety five. And it's a US size two, which I don't know what that means. I just picked the smallest one I could find and tried it on because I like my t shirts to be tight. Certain ones. And it's just a Beatles t shirt. I love the Beatles, but I could never find a t-shirt that fit me that I liked. I've seen some in the men's department at Kohl's, where I work, but the smalls were just too big on me. Like, they're too baggy, and they didn't fit me the way I wanted them to fit me. So, that's in my face. I'm just like that. I'm not a fan of crew necks either, but this one actually fits, so it's not a big deal. God, it has a mess of hair. Yeah. Okay. Next, clothing item. I only got three clothing items. The rest are accessories because those are the easiest to look at and they were the least expensive. And this was twenty four ninety five. Yep, and it's extra small. Extra small is a little snug. Damn it! Don't mind me. Extra small is a little snug, but the small is a huge, and I don't get why. But originally, I tried it on the medium, and it looked like I was floating in it. So I'm not gonna unbutton all of it. So I'm just gonna put it on over my head. And the color is like a dusty pink. Color. 
They had it in black and cream and a bunch of other colors, I believe. This is the color I wanted, so. And it's got brown buttons. So it looks like this. So this is the book. I'll show you that. And it's got little pockets. I think it's cute. So once I lose weight in my arms, I'll be perfect. So I'm pretty sure this is pink. I might be blind though. It might be brown. It doesn't tell me. It looks pink to me. Or oatmeal. To me, it's dusty pink, so it's gonna be dusty pink. I have color issues. I cannot see certain colors. Like at all. I was looking at a purse that was light brown, and I thought it was light pink. So, it's probably light brown. So it's not telling me. It looks pink to me. It's either light brown or light pink, whatever, it's still cute. So. It's kind of pricey, I usually pay like 15 for a cardigan, but yeah. That's just in this little baggie. Okay. These earrings are hoops, and these are $5.95, which is pretty pricey, but I was like, oh my god, these are so adorable. They're like little Victorian hoops. I really don't own any hoops at all. And these have little pearls and lemon keys and they're silver. So that sold it for me. So I hate gold jewelry. I haven't tried them on yet. I hope they're not heavy. They don't seem to be too heavy. I'm hoping they're not. Then I got this set of bangles. This was $5.95 as well. They got little ones of studs and then I got this in a extra small small. I got some small wrists. I don't want a bangles outfit. Yeah. And then I got this set of bracelets for five ninety five. Wait, no, wrong one. This is three ninety five. So these are three ninety five, and it says divide on it. I don't know what that means. I don't really care what that means. Or divided. It's pretty cute. Three ninety five is a good price. The earrings are pricey, but it's okay. And I got these rings in small, which I hope means that they're actually small and will fit my fingers. I want ones that fit this finger or this finger, or maybe the middle finger, just any finger. Um, these are only five ninety five, and it came, comes with a set of five rings. I got this one right here. Then this one, see, it has like little balls on the top. This one has two big crystals and there are two different sizes. This one has little pearls on it. This one has, is broken. That's cool. You don't realize that. I probably won't like any of it. It looks really gaudy. But yeah, this one's broken. It's awesome. Yeah, it was supposed to have a stone in there, I'm guessing. This one has three pearls. It's okay. Still a good deal. Not good jewelry, apparently, but next I got this headband, and I still think this is light pink. It matches the thing, but it might be brown, because it's got chocolate brown on it. So yeah, this was three, <coughs> five ninety five. It's cute. It's like a lightish pink brown, which I just found out the cardigan is a light brown with a pink tone to it. I don't know, it makes it more neutral, so I can wear it with more things. Okay, next set. I still can't believe that ring was broken, but... Yeah, this is a bunch of, like, pearl studs. This is three ninety five, And they got pink, gold, gold, silver, black, gunmetal, silver, pink. It's like reddish, silver, white, and a blue. Keeps getting interrupted, so hopefully I can get through this video. But yeah, these pearls were 
395. Pretty cute. Oh, and then I got another ring set in small, and these are 595. None of these are broken, thankfully. Oh, my hair looks all wrapped. I'm trying on those clothes. Yeah. One's a little basic, one with a stone, and then there's one with a pearl and a little bow. And there's one that says love. And then there's one that's basic ball things again. And one's the other one. It's just a basic band. And then there's another ball one. To wear them together. So I really like that. Then this is our Victorian type set. And it's got these bows. And it's got little pendant looking things right there. I forgot what they're called. I can't remember the name. I just can't remember right now. And then it has this basic stud. And it has these little hanging pearls which are so cute. So yep. That is what I got today. And I have no idea how long the video is because it's like eight pieces. So yep. Thank you guys for watching. And yeah. Tell me what you think about H&M I guess. And what you recommend to look for when I go there next. Or what you look for, all that. Thank you for watching. See ya.